if the problem with your dryer is that it's not starting in any of the cycles that you try it on, in other words, the dryer is dead, the first thing you need to check are the voltages at the terminal block. To do that, you need a voltage tester like this one. You could use the web address shown on the picture to get one like this one if you like. Disconnect the dryer from the wall outlet. Then go behind the dryer and remove the terminal block cover plate. Take a plastic coat hanger and cut two pieces like this. Tape the two coat hanger pieces to the test probes like this. This way you could use it like this without risking touching any electrical wires, okay? If you're comfortable working with electricity, then you could use the tester just like this. I just don't want anybody to get hurt, okay? Connect the dryer back to the wall outlet. You will need to check the voltage between these two terminals. The 110 and 220 lights should light up. You will need to check the voltage between these two terminals. Only the 110 volt light should light up. You will need to check the voltage between these two terminals. Only the 110 volt light should light up. If the lights on the tester don't light up the way explained, the problem could be a blown fuse, a trip circuit breaker, a bad wall outlet, or a bad power cord. This is the end of this video. Thank you. If you like my videos, click on the subscribe button to subscribe to my channel. You could also click on the center link to watch my latest video. Or you could click on my website link to go to my website and view all the videos according to the problem with your washer or dryer. Signing out, your friend, the appliance man.